didn't draw these pictures. This is historical evidence, historical fact that these things happen. Now these things only happen to so who? We can disassemble all the lies we've been taught when we come back to the word of God. That's right. You are not the who the Bible calls the seed of Israel. Catholicism, Christianity, is white supremacy. Round one, fight!
about? What's your name, sister? Miss Julia. Miss Julia, watch this. Read it again. But it shall come to pass, uh -huh. if thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. If the so-called blacks, all right, they did not listen to the word of God, if they didn't hearken, come on, to observe, to do all his commandments. If we didn't do all the commandments, what? And the statutes uh -huh. which I command thee this day, uh -huh. that all these curses. So, Miss Julia, it said all of these what? What did it say? How you doing, sister? Come forward. I just want you to. Yeah. What did you say, Miss Julia? Yeah. All these curses. These curses. My brothers, is a curse a good thing or a bad thing? It's a bad thing. Great evil. So now let's read some of the curses and see what people can identify with themselves of who they are. How you doing, sister? You? You've heard of this, uh, Miss Julia, don't leave yet. Y'all have heard of the transatlantic slave trade, right? That's how we were brought here to this island, correct? The majority, yes, yes. That is in the Bible, let's get that. Deuteronomy 28, 16. All of this, we didn't draw these pictures, right? This is historical evidence, historical fact that these things happen. Now, these things only happen to who, Miss Julia? The, sl the slave ships. They don't sell about Revelation. How you doing, my brother? Stick around. Watch this. Come on. Book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 68. Miss Julia, don't leave real quick. Stick with me. We're going to get there. Don't leave. Come on. And, and the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. So, what was happening to the children of Israel when we were in Egypt, Miss Julia? What were we? Pharaoh was keeping us as what? As slaves. You're right. You're right. So, the Bible is calling captivity or slavery. It's, uh, it's combining that with the word Egypt. Egypt means slavery in the Bible. Come on. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. Into slavery again. Watch this, Miss Julia. With what? With ships. With what? Ships. How were the blacks of the island of Dominica brought here? With ships. We were brought here on cargo slave ships, y'all. So now you got to ask yourself, why is what happened to us? Called it, the, the people in the Bible called Israelites. Because we are the Israelites. Yes. Yes. You are the people Moses prophesied to that said either keep his commandments and live or be in captivity and die. It's not done though. Watch this. Come on. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again with ships. Uh -huh. By the way where I spake unto thee, uh -huh. thou shalt see it no more again. Meaning we're not going to see our homeland again, Miss Julia. They tell us we're from Africa, right? But what country in Africa? It's over 52 nations in Africa. Which one do we come from? We don't know. But watch this code. And there ye shall be sold unto your enemies. Miss Julia, it said what? We will be what? We will be, did you catch that? Read it again for the sister. And there ye shall be sold. You shall be what? Sold. After we got off the slave ships, we were what? Sold. Did that happen to us? Let's look at this. Let's look at this. Right, right here. 1619 transatlantic right. slave trade. Jeez. Right? We weren't brought here by request. They forced our people, men, women, and children on these boats right. to come here and work in the sugar cane fields, right? right. In the rice paddies, right? right? Why are these things happening to us? Because we are the children of Israel the Bible is talking about. Right. Right. Watch this. Go to James 1 and 1 real quick. It's not just here. Again, we come from all over America to teach our people this word. Because for too long, like you said, the pastors, they have done us a disservice in Dominica. They have not told you, thus said the Lord, right? The Bible says that the preachers today, they preach for hire. Right? Watch this, sister. Come on. Look at James chapter 1, verse 1. Uh -huh. James, a servant of God uh -huh. and of the Lord uh -huh. Jesus Christ. Doing, to the 12 tribes. To the 12 tribes, the so-called blacks, Native Indians, and Hispanics. Read. Which are scattered. Which, which are what? Which are scattered. How were we scattered? Deuteronomy 28, 64. The Bible said the 12 tribes of Israel will be scattered throughout the whole earth. All four corners of the earth. That's why you can go anywhere and you can see black faces. Right. You know? So, how did they scatter us, my sister, Miss Julia? And I didn't get your name. What's your name, sister? Julie, too? That must be a popular name around here. We got two sisters, Julie. Watch this, sis. We're going to read out the Bible, thus said the Lord, right? What's going on, my brother? 
Deuteronomy 28, verse 64. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 64. Uh -huh. And the Lord shall scatter thee. The Lord shall scatter us. How you doing, little sister? Miss Julia, did they scatter us? Did they scatter our people? How did they do it? Different religions. False religions, right? Glinda. Miss Linda. Glinda, Glinda. Glinda. We were scattered, thus said the Lord. Watch this, we little gift everybody just came up, brother. And the Lord shall scatter thee uh -huh. among all people uh -huh. from the one end of the earth uh -huh. even unto the other. From all ends of the earth. Now, as a people, we have to consider this. Why are the things that the Lord said happening to the Israelites? Why are they happening to us? That would make, no. that would make us who? Who would that make us? We have to make us the children of Israel. That's right. So he said we were scattered. Let's get a little bit more history on it. Today is the day that the people of Dominica are going to learn the word of God. That's right. And his chosen people, the right. children of Israel, my family. Right. Come on. And the Lord shall scatter thee among all people, uh -huh. from the one end of the earth, uh -huh. even unto the other. Come on. And there thou shalt serve other gods. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now let's deal with a sensitive topic. It said after we were scattered, we were served. What? And there thou shalt serve other gods. It said we will serve other gods. What other gods are we serving now? Get up. On the island of Dominica. What, what religion? False gods? Like who? Like what religion? Help me out. Now you can say this. Don't be ashamed. We out here to teach the word and boldness. Look at this. This is how we were scattered. If I'm young people today, watch this. Little sister, let me ask you a question. Come here. Come here real quick. I just want to ask you a question. What's this? Hold on, Miss Julie. Who is this? Who is this man? Who would you call this man? You would call it Jesus. I want to ask the little sister now. Little sister. Who is this man? You would call that Jesus? I want you to open up your flyer now. Look. You'll see an image that looks like this. This is not it. Jesus. You just, hold on, hold on, my sister. You said this is a demon? Why are you saying that? Is it? Are you saying a demon because he has skin like you? Okay, let's get that. So, remember, we're coming out the Bible. Give me Revelations 1. Remember, we have to read the Bible precept upon precept. That's right. This is a life. This is the image of the beast. That's right. In 1492, Christi uh, Christopher Columbus came over here, and he colonized this island, and then he talked to Roman Catholicism. That's, right. That's where this image came from. He gave you a false god, and then made you slaves. Catholicism, Christianity, is white supremacy. Yes, Let's right. find out what Jesus Christ looked like today. Come on. The book of Revelation, chapter 1 and verse 1. Yes. The revelation. So the Bible says the revelation, that means to reveal. We are going to reveal to the people today what the true image of Christ looked like. Right. Yes, this. Come on. The revelation of Jesus Christ. Of who? Jesus Christ. Okay, that's the topic. We're talking about the revelation of Jesus Christ. Let's see what he looked like, my family, all right? Now, the sister said he's a demon. Many of us will see this, and because he has skin the same color of ours, we disassociate ourselves with it, and we say this, this is foreign to us now. What does the Bible say? Come on. Revelation 1 and verse 14. Come on. You know? His head and his hair uh -huh. were white like wool. White like wool. What color is this hair, little sister? Wait, I didn't get your name. What is it? Anna. Anna. Anna? What color is his hair? White. The Bible said Christ's hair was what? His head and his hands were white like wool. Like my hair, like your hair, like this little brother's hair with dreads. You don't see this image with white woolly hair because this is the image of the beast. That's right. This is not Jesus Christ. Come on. So that's strike one. All right. So now let's do some thinking as we read this. Come on. As white as snow. As what? As white as snow. You see my hair? White as snow. Not blonde, not brown. The Messiah had hair that was white and woolly. And his eyes. And his what? His eyes. His what? His eyes. Was what? Were as a flame of fire. Meaning what color? If there's a color of a flame of fire, sister. It's what color? Because Christ drunk wine. That's right. That's right. See how easy it is. We can disassemble all the lies we've been taught. When we come back to the word of God. That's right. So he said his eyes were the flame of fire, meaning red. He drank wine in moderation. The same way on the island, we drank a little rum. What happens to our eyes? They become red. So That's you right. because you know what I'm talking about. Come on, hold on, don't we? Now, here, white and woolly hair, red eyes. Let's 
see what color his skin was. Come on. And his feet. So I can see your feet, Miss Julie, right? Your feet are the same color as the rest of your body, right? That's right, you know? Yes, yes. Watch this. Come on. And his feet. Uh -huh. Like unto fine brass. So what color is brass, man? What color is brass, Miss Julie? Brass. Gold. A gold is brown color, right? Similar to color like a penny. Like copper. So if I have a copper penny, right? Read. And his feet. Like unto fine brass. Uh -huh.